Ladies and gentlemen, we are back in Code Fights, the intro section, diving deeper, doing first digit. Now, the the task that we are asked to do is we need to find the first digit in a string. So the leftmost digit. So in var underscore one, that would be one, and we need to return it as a string. Q2Q dash Q, et cetera, et cetera. You guys get the idea. Just return the first digit. The way that I did this was I created a digit array. So let's go ahead and do that. And this went from zero to one. Oops, excuse me, not like that. These are individual characters. One, two, three, four, five, six, oops, six, seven, eight, and finally nine. So we want to find that very first digit, so this is enough to do what we need. From there, I took our input string, which our input string here is just a simple string, and I broke it up into an array. Uh, an array of strings, right? Then we're going to iterate through that array for the entire string, or until we hit a truth value in our if statement. And we are going to say, hey, if that digits array dot includes, includes is a, um, a uh, array function that will get return a true or fa false value to check if a number or a value is in that array. And we can do that with our, our input here. So if the current item that we're iterating on in our array is included in our digits array, the first time that hits, we just have to return it. And uh, there's not like a true or false to this, so uh, all that, there's a, in the way this is set up, there's at least one, a string containing at least one digit, so we don't have to do return an empty case or anything like that for that. And that's it. Let's go ahead and run our test and submit it. Probably a bunch of different ways you could do this one. Uh, this is how I, uh, I did it. I thought it was a, you know, pretty pretty straightforward. To, uh, create a create a, essentially a database to to search through. Turn the string into an array of characters, and then iterate through the characters and find out uh, the first one that hits your digits array using the includes array function. But um, as always, guys, I'm, I'm interested in how you solve these problems. I hope you leave your solutions in the comments, as well as some context if you solved it in a different way or even a different language, right? I, I do all these in JavaScript. A lot of people will be uh, interested to see your solutions as well. So uh, I appreciate you guys watching the video. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and share. And if you'd like to support me on Patreon and join the Facebook group, Discord channel, all that stuff is in the description. I appreciate you watching. I'll see you guys next time. Hey guys, thanks for watching the video. Special thanks to our sponsors, Dev Mountain. If you're looking for a coding boot camp where tuition and housing is included, definitely check them out. Appreciate it, and I'll see you guys in the next video.